Hey, what's up? This is your boy Doggy Diamonds. Are you a singer? Are you a rapper? Are you a reggae artist? Are you a comedian? Then come on out and showcase your talent at the Step Your Bars Up Showcase. The event is being held at the Paper Box, 17 Meadow Street in Brooklyn, New York, 11206 on Tuesday, May 24th. Come on out. Look, the registration fee is only $150. All acts will have a live performance filmed by Forbes DVD and featured on ForbesDVD.com. You can't beat that. For more information, make sure you email ForbesDVDShowcase at gmail.com or contact 646-397-7095 or click the link in the description box for more info. It's going to take you right to the website, which you go right to the PayPal information. Peace. Forbesdvd.com The dude Ebro said on something one day, he said, they asked the nigga where he got hot nigga from. Gee, it's not hot nigga. He says, oh yeah, I got it from. I don't know who he said. The nigga was lying. See, that's the shit. You know what I mean? And it was clear to see because I did it on the timeline. Mm -hmm. I was tweeting hot nigga over and over again, over mm -hmm. and over again. I started bashing hot 97. I said, hot 97 is false feeding us this Troy Average nigga because he has a Puerto Rican nigga on his team that's related to all the Puerto Rican niggas there. Wow. You understand what I'm saying? And that's what they doing because the Puerto Rican niggas run radio in New York City. Mm -hmm. So I said, this fucking nigga, they pushing this nigga in everywhere where he not supposed to be. Like, hot 97 had the dude on the motherfucking... On the, on, the, on, the, on the stage, on the, on the festivals, they had him on the main stage mm -hmm. opening up and they had Mac Wiles who just got nominated for a Grammy on a festival stage. And meanwhile, Mac Wiles' song was lit that summer, you know what I mean? Fair. So that's when I knew, I said, no, I'm going in on these dudes. These dudes is being disrespectful and they're not respecting the culture. So I said, yo, Bobby Schmurter is the hottest nigga in Brooklyn right now. That young nigga is on fire. And he's like, what? And who, and who says that? I said, I say that in the people, nigga. I said, oh, you want me to do a poll? So then I said, yo, what's better? G, um, GS9 hot nigga or Troy Ave, your style. And it was not one tweet. They said Troy Ave, your style. You know what I'm saying? In Brooklyn, people are new about Bobby Schmurter record. It was a landslide. Yeah, so that day he said, yo, he said on the show, yo, email me the record. And it just was weird to see him on another interview, like, yeah, I had got that from such and such. Like, these niggas so corny. I don't even care about the see, credit, that, tell that, you the that, truth. That's the point I'm making, so though. It, it, you go all out your way, my nigga. Like, people know what it is. Everybody knows mm -hmm. Tax Stone had, you know, something to do with that whole GS9, Bobby Smurr, the hot nigga shit. Everybody know that. That's a that's a proven fact. The industry, the streets, niggas on, on the internet. And you will make yourself look that crazy just to not give it up. Just to not give somebody else credit. Shit, it'd be crazy. And it's nigga. cool. I ain't even mad. Just like I said, I don't be mad at these dudes. They just show their character though. flow. You sleep good at night. Very good. Exactly. Very That's good. my thing. I sleep good at night. Cause I, I, know, I know I won't do it. That's why I said, man, there's so much shit. Believe me, yo, sometimes a bitch nigga could bring some bitch shit out of you. And it's some bitch shit and every nigga sitting somewhere. Yeah. I've done some bitch shit to niggas. And sometimes I don't mind doing no bitch shit because it'd be like, sometimes you got to fight fire with fire. Yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Exactly. You, you gotta fight five. Yo, exactly. yo, I never called the police before. I tell a story for a nigga call me a snitch or whatever. I had a fucking neighbor that kept calling the cops on me, son, and didn't give a fuck. I started calling the cops on that bitch. I kind of, you ain't gonna keep sending the cops to my crib. I'm in here smoking weed and shit. You keep sending these motherfuckers to the door. I started making up shit on her. I started calling bitches. Yo, call the cops on this bitch right now and say, that they fighting in the crib. Like, I'm gonna show her what it is to get interrupted by the police when you yeah, in, the, in the comfortability shit. of your home about to jerk off you want to fucking send the cops to my door. What the fuck is wrong with you? Like, this shit is crazy, beloved. Like, niggas yo, mad comfortable. Yo, you fucking movie like on some real shit. Like. Hey, what's up? This is your boy, Doggy Diamonds. Are you a singer? Are you a rapper? Are you a reggae artist? Are you a comedian? Then come on out and showcase your talent at the Step Your Bars Up Showcase. The event is being held at the Paper Box, 17 Meadow Street in Brooklyn, New York, 11206, on Tuesday, May 24th. Come on out. Look, the registration fee is only $150. All acts will have a live performance filmed by Forbes DVD and featured on ForbesDVD.com. You can't beat that. For more information, make sure you email ForbesDVDShowcase at gmail.com or contact 
7095 or click the link in the description box for more info. It's going to take you right to the website which you go right to the PayPal information. Peace. Forbesdvd.com